This is FBI 10 Most Wanted Fugitive Eduardo Ravello. Take a closer look at this photograph taken in 1998. Do you recognize this alleged murderer? Here is an age-enhanced photograph of what Ravello could look like in recent years, though he may have had plastic surgery. The FBI is offering an up to $100,000 reward for information leading directly to Ravello's arrest. An FBI agent investigating this case says Ravello is known as the highest ranking capo or captain of the Barrio Azteca gang in Mexico. He is a captain. He's the shot caller. He's responsible for everything that happens within the Barrio Azteca gang. Take a listen to Ravello speaking his native language, Spanish, to see if it's familiar. <laughs> Ravello was most recently indicted on charges relating to the March 13, 2010 murders of U.S. consulate employee Leslie Enriquez, who was four months pregnant, and her husband, Arthur Redolfs. It happened in Juarez, Mexico, as the family was driving back from a child's birthday party. The couple's seven-month-old daughter was also in the car, but was not hurt. The husband of another consulate employee, Jorge Salcido Ceniceros, was killed in a separate vehicle. Barrio Azteca gang members under Ravello meant to target a rival gang, but shot the victims anyway. Ruben Redoff lost his brother, Arthur, in the shooting. Great guy, just a gentle, gentle man and I miss him every day. Ravello was born in Mexico, but has ties to El Paso, Texas. As you can see, he has tattoos, a scorpion on his chest, and a picture of Jesus on his back. Ravello uses aliases. He goes by tablas, which is tables, lumbermen, two by four, all those things that have to do with wood, because that's what he would use when he would beat people up and torture people. If you have any information about Ravello, dial 1-800-CALL-FBI or visit the FBI's website at tips.fbi.gov. With Wanted by the FBI, I'm Molly Halpern of the Bureau.